asking why I'm struggling Stay It's a mystery why I'm here I guess I'm just too tired of watch my other videos you may have noticed that I have switched rooms this used to be my bedroom but I'm now in the attic and that's my new bedroom because we're gonna have some more people move into the place we're living right now for the summer and then next year and so they're gonna be living here so I moved my stuff out but today the beds are coming right out in the vacuum because they're coming at some point I'm gonna also need to move the couch out of here I'm moving it to the living room and then I have to move the chairs that are in the living room out of there so we have room for the couch it's a big process but let's hope it's fun. I finished exams a couple days ago, so now I just have a bunch of like housework that needs to be done, like this. I still need to move some more stuff up to my room, but the main stuff is gone. I need to paint the furniture outside. That furniture needs to be painted. At some point I need to get fake grass for out there too, but they didn't have it at the store like last week, so that might have to be pushed to a different time. But yeah, so right now I need a vacuum, and then I'll maybe start moving the chair so that I can move the couch. It's gonna be a whole process, guys. Hope you're, you're ready for the ride. Yeah. So these are the two chairs that have to be moved. I think we're going to try to move this one maybe downstairs and then this one to the attic even though there really is not space in the attic. I'll move this one first. This is gonna be, it's gonna be tough. We did it friends. It was definitely a struggle but we did it because the, the thing is the stairs going up are fine they're just about wide enough for the chair but the stairs going up to the attic are very very narrow so they are not wide enough for the chair so we had to do a little maneuver where we like are lifting the chair and turning it just right so it just squeezes through and like there's only not enough room my room for it but it's fine because my room's not completely done like i don't have a wardrobe so right now i just have a bunch of clothes like in buckets and everything and like i'm gonna get a wardrobe at some point in like june when that happens i can remove some of the piles of clothes that i have right now and i will hopefully have space for the chair then so right now like the chair is there it doesn't look good but like it's there and it's fine and it will work now i need to move this one downstairs which should be a lot a lot easier Like, now I have to move the couch up here. <laughs> so now the couch is gone. So I think that what's gonna happen is I'm gonna put one of the beds here and then one of the beds in that room. So if one bed's here, I think I'll keep the desk here and probably move this chair into that room, I think. I don't know if this will actually work. Because if the bed's like this big and this long, I don't think the chair will fit in here after I just moved it in here. I don't know how the hell I was in here five seconds ago. Try this. Oh, this might be it. That was it. I knew we'd figure it out. I knew we'd figure it out. Again, don't know where it's gonna fit in here, but it'll fit somewhere. If the bed goes there and the table's there. The chair. 
it might just get rid of the chair. It might just. Okay, so this is the new setup. Basically, I moved the, the clothing rack over and put the chair there by the bathroom. Not the most convenient when you're leaving the bathroom, but I don't think it's too big of an issue. I think it, it looks fine in that corner. And then this is, again, temporary situation right now. I think it's fine. Time to vacuum though, because I really need to vacuum my room. Um, I've been needing to vacuum it for a hot sec now, because there's just like dust and stuff. And like, like I don't even know, there's just stuff on the floor. I don't know how I get this stuff on the floor. Like there's like this ball of string. Like I don't know how this gets here, but I just need to vacuum it all up now because it's been frustrating me. Okay, hi friends, my camera's dying so I'm gonna have to charge it, sorry. I got busy doing other stuff that I did not record. I had to like rebook my flight tickets to go back home later this year. And then I had a call and then I was on FaceTime, but I'm done now. So now we're going to assemble the beds. My camera's dying, so I'm gonna charge it and then I'll, we'll come back. You'll see me later. It won't be later for you, but it will be later in real life. You'll see me doing the beds. And I'm gonna watch Supernatural as I do it. That's that. It's growing stronger cause it's me that I'm fighting Now that I see what is hiding underneath my skin And I'm always sorry Okay, so it's like 2am now and I feel like I've not made good progress Unfortunately, apparently building a bed is a lot harder than I thought it would be so we have this part done. So basically it's like a day bed that will be a real bed with drawers underneath. So this is like the drawer outside and I have to make drawers to the insides. And I'm working on the bed right now, like the, the bed part, but it's not going into the pieces it needs to go into properly. I really think they were right about it being a two person job. I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, and I'm one person, so it's not going as planned. It's 2 a.m. and I'm going to bed. And that's just how it's gonna have to be. I'll finish in the morning. And it's really upsetting also because I have to make two of these. I have to make two beds. I can't even freaking make this one, clearly. And this panel keeps falling off. This one panel keeps falling off. It's very, very upsetting. But I watched a bunch of Supernatural and the summer I turned pretty, so I'm happy. I'm happy camper. I'm going to bed. I don't wanna, I don't wanna stay up anymore and do this. So, good night. See you tomorrow. Good morning friends, it's the next day. It's like the afternoon already, but I got up late. And right now I'm about to leave to go out to meet up with my friend Garrison. And we're gonna go to the store, cause we need to get some stuff, but also gonna, I think, get pizza. And then he's gonna come back and help me build the beds. Yes. So I'm excited about that. Hopefully with our efforts combined, we can get them done today. I would like that, cause I don't wanna have to keep working on them. It's painful to me. Come along on my day. We're back at the house building the beds. First, we need to fix one of the panels, but then we have to do. Um, What's well, good? We build in a bed. There, that's all it needs to be said. Amazing. We build in a bed. I don't know what I'm doing, but I have tools. She knows what she's doing, and she doesn't have tools. Hence, I'm here. Wow, that, that is almost, that looks like a day bed. That was. It is a day bed. Oh, this is lovely. 
Hello vlog. I had some fun with some makeup that I bought today. Just playing around, because I never played around with makeup when I was a kid. Like when you're five years old and you play around with makeup, I never did that. So I did just now and I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, this is what I've done. I think it's really, really cool. Do I look intimidating? This is my alter ego, Bertha. And then I colored my nose blue to look like the girl from Willy Wonka by when she eats the blueberry. Um, and this is a Cleopatra and then a murderer. So yeah, that's the look today. I hope you guys um, like it. Let's take a guess what time it is. Let's just take a wild guess here. 4.30 in the morning. I finished the second bed though. So it really doesn't matter what time it is because I have accomplished my task. And it has drawers. I feel like I did that drawer a little bit wrong because it just doesn't feel right, but it, it works. So I'm not going to change it because it already took me freaking long enough to get it right in the first place. Sorry, I heard a noise. But yeah, so it's 4.30 in the morning, so I'm going to bed now. But I just wanted to show you that I did get the final bed done. And the, uh, the first bed was done already. I'll, sh I'll show you a little clip. There's the first bed. I still need to get mattress protectors for it, but whatever. There's the first bed in all, in all its glory. And then you walk in here, and here's the second bed. And then there's like closets and whatnot. So it's slaying. Do I look tired? I feel like I look tired. We have more work to do tomorrow though, so. Stay tuned for that. It'll be great. It'll be great. Hello friends. Welcome. It is the next morning. Um, it's like late in the afternoon now. It's like 2 o'clock, but I got up pretty late. I got up at like 11.30 and then we had to have um, someone come by to fix our boiler and I was not going to film that obviously because personal privacy and um so that was done and then i just like took a shower and got dressed so i haven't really done anything but right now claire grace and i are gonna paint which i'm really excited about because i love painting and then later we're gonna have a little photo shoot because we do like monthly photo shoots so we're gonna have a monthly photo shoot i have all the stuff i need to do today those are some of the more fun activities but let's come along for the ride also i got these earrings yesterday at claire's and i really like them because i saw some girl with like thin hoop earrings the other day and i was like those look so sick because for a while i liked um chunkier small hoop earrings but she had like big thin hoop earrings i was like well, i kind of like those so i went to claire's yesterday and they had like a pack of like three hoop earrings in like different sizes, like thin ones though. And so I'm wearing them today and I really like them. I'm like a big fan of them. And I like the outfit Jeff because it's like, I don't know if you can see, it's like all green and it all matches. Not that I'm like doing anything, but I'm just happy with it. Okay, let's go. There might be a bit of paper left under the pool of coffee. Try to remember what I wrote and you just laugh. You better have a talk Think it might last until it's dark When the candlelights are out I really think it's goodbye I didn't love Okay, so it's time for our monthly photo shoot with the other girls. And this month is May, so we're doing Mother's Day themed. Even though it's not Mother's Day in Ireland, it's like American Mother's Day. So we're doing Mother's Day themed. So we're all dressing up as like moms or like pregnant women. I'm gonna go with a trashy mom. So messy bun, hoop earrings, milf shirt. I'll make myself pregnant, we'll get like a ball or something. And then I'll do like eyeliner and like bags under my eyes and heavy makeup. Oh my gosh. I think it, it looks heavier on that camera than it does in real life. It looks like I have a black eye. Okay, this is the look. It looks really bright in that light. 
Um, but basically I did red to make it look more tired and my lips are paler from the bags in my eyes. It definitely looks less intense in real life. It looks really intense on the camera, I think. Because I want to look like a tired, pregnant mom. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Alright. Here. Here's the, here's the look. The photographer. Oh my goodness! Push, Chloe! I need your hand! <laughs> I am the doctor. Come on, Chloe! Push! 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 Oh my goodness! Oh, she's beautiful. <laughs> Take two. Push, Chloe! Push! Uh, Hold on. Go cut the umbilical cord. Okay, hold on. Uh. Oh, she's beautiful. <laughs> she looks just like the father. What a dog he must have been. <laughs> <laughs> dirty, dirty dog. Oh my god. <laughs> These are the final paintings from before. This is Chloe's. They're all Taylor Swift songs. So Chloe's is clean. Chloe, would you like to explain? The chorus goes, rain came pouring down when I was drowning. Mm-hmm. And that's when I could finally breathe. Nice. So as you can see, she was drowning. Now it's raining. And she can finally breathe. She's breathing. breathing water. Yeah. Okay. That's She's good. That's exactly how I intended it to look. That's great, Chloe. <laughs> This is mine. It's from You Are In Love, and it's morning, <laughs> his place, burnt toast, it's Sunday, you keep his shirt, and that's where the lines end for me. But that's that, so it's um, You Are In Love. This is Grace's. Grace. Vigilante mm -hmm. Cat eyes sharp enough to kill a man. She's doing her cat eyes with a knife. Mm. This is just like lip biting because I feel like- It goes with the vibe. Yeah, it's a good vibe. It, it's like a representation of the song. Yeah. Then this is because the wife is driving the husband's bent. And then this is a letter. <laughs> just evidence for his crimes. And she's dressing for revenge because he's stupid. Yeah, it's the dance. And this is her performing it. On stage to millions of people. Yeah. These are the final pieces together. Welcome back. We went to see the new Guardians of the Galaxy movie and it was actually pretty good. I liked it. I don't know if I actually saw the second one. I feel like I probably didn't, but I definitely think I saw the first Guardians of the Galaxy, but it like was not hard to follow along with. And yeah, it was a good, good time. But now I'm frustrated because I'm really tired. It's really late. It's like 1 a.m. and um, my room's a mess and I need to clean it and I need to pack because I'm going to Paris tomorrow. Um, luckily it's not a 5 a.m. flight, like, all my flights usually are at an obnoxious time. It's actually, like, in the afternoon, so I'm gonna get a bus, um, around 9 o'clock, which is nice that I can sleep in a little bit later than I usually do, because usually my flights are at obnoxious hours, I need to wake up, like, 4 a.m., but I don't need to this time. I can wake up at, like, a healthy, like, 8-ish, low before 8, which is pretty good. Um, but yeah, let's, let's clean my room. So, I've cleaned my room, ta-da, I've packed, I'm just doing a few more things before I go to bed, but like I'm heading to bed basically right now. I hope you enjoyed the vlog, um, stay tuned for the next one because it's going to be my Paris vlog because I'm going tomorrow, so I think that's probably the order that I'm uploading these, but yeah, thanks for watching, bye!